Hey guys, how are you doing? Uh, so in this video, I'm going to share a preview of a hobby project. Uh, I'm going to use a Raspberry Pi's uh, camera and streaming that camera to my local computer and using uh, the computing resource, which is the Coral Edge TPU, to do some machine learning uh, object detection jobs. So here in this window is my uh, Raspberry Pi. I, I just use the VNC to monitor it and type in commands like this. And then this is my uh, local development environment. Uh, so the project here is, is uh, all the libraries you can see, right? Uh, which I just uh, wrote it myself based on lots of the knowledge from the website. And here is another window. Uh, this window uh, takes care of the transfer of the whole library from my local host computer to the Raspberry Pi here. Uh, which I've already done. So, uh, in the later, I will give you a detailed tutorial of uh, what are all these things and which library I used. So, right now is a demonstration of this project. In Raspberry Pi, uh, you just need to run this command, uh, which is a Python uh, script uh, that is called a sender stream.py. So after you run it, you will see all the status. So when you see uh, the RPI stream is start streaming, then in your computer, you can type this command, like uh, here. Uh, so in the computer side, this is the receiver of the stream, right? Okay, when you type that, you will see all the process, like uh, loading in all the TPU models, etc. And then you will see the receiver start st streaming. And I will see a picture, uh, not a picture, a video like this. So I put a cute cup here. You can see this is a Starbucks cup uh, I bought from Utah, which I love a lot. Okay, so the core is you see the live streaming uh, object detection FPS can be as high as a 35 something, maybe more than 35. And if I move around this cup a little bit, you can see how uh, it is performing. I, I will say the model will do a pretty decent job. And here in the receiver's uh, terminal, you can see the live FPS and also the uh, time components per frame uh, processing. Uh, like how much time is spending on receiving the raw image and how time it spent on to de decompress it and how long it takes to load the image and also finally the TPU inference it. And from the Raspberry Pi side you can see okay the sender statics, uh, statistics like the sender's FPS uh, also per frame time uh, is divided into groups like uh, uh, camera time as camera only take a, a little bit time and uh, the compressing time and also you can see the sending uh, takes a lot of time that means the networking time okay oh right now you see the fps is uh, as high as uh, 45 something here right i would say it's a pretty great performance uh, it it has the capability to detect uh, multiple objects and not only a cup but uh, what i'm showing here is just a cup Okay, uh, so today is just a preview. Later I will show a very detailed tutorial and sharing my uh, scripts, uh, programs on the GitHub to everyone who views my video. Okay, goodbye.